Hey, what's up guys? Hopefully everybody's having a fantastic day. And welcome back to another Call of Duty Zombies video. In this video, we're going to be playing the Custom Zombies map, Quiet Residence. This map is no joke, bro. This is definitely not my first attempt. The map might have 27 perks, but does not make it easy. And the attempt right before this one, I got pretty freaking far. And then I looked over and I didn't even press record. So yeah, I'm pretty butthurt right now. Totally my fault, but oh my goodness, man. Oh my gosh. This spawn room is freaking annoying. There we go. Somehow we survived that. Yeah, round two is always a little sketchy because they just pour out of the freaking barriers. And you don't have enough for this gun yet, so <laughs> got to be careful. Trying to get the most out of this double points. We'll grab it. Get a bunch of headshots. Or at least try. These zombies like to move back and forth so much. Heck yeah, we're not doing too bad. We'll open this door. We got a key right here. Then we'll open this door up. Got another key. And we got a freaking soul box to fill up. There's a bunch of these cats around the map. Uh, I don't remember how many there are. I think it's like four. Come on, zombie. I really do like this map. I feel like it's too hard, but I can't really complain about a map being too hard. I just need to get good. Knowing the mouse finally got his cheese, it fills you with determination. And all you got to do is press X and it'll give you some freaking like a thousand points. That's pretty cool. Grab this insta kill. Got a lot of bottles right here. Ooh, some tombstone. So yeah, I got to be careful in these early rounds because I find myself getting really stupid downs. Oh my goodness. Get out of here, zombies. I think it's almost complete. Maybe one more zombie. Whoa, that zombie came flying around that corner. My goodness. We'll grab our points. Open this door up. And here's the room with all the perks. Freaking crazy, bro. Grab some quick revive. And we can't get jugged just yet. So yeah, there's another soul box right here, but I'm trying not to get trapped. There's actually a lot of zombies. That's crazy. Open this door up, and we got the power. Oh my goodness, and the zombies like to do a little- Whoa, whoa, Yeah, there's a spawn point right here I totally forgot about. We definitely need to pay attention to that. Yeah, these early rounds are sketchy, and then we finally get set up, and then it's too high of a round, so those rounds are also sketchy. So yeah, pretty much all the rounds are sketchy on this map. We'll grab the key. So yeah, the Easter eggs for this map are actually pretty simple. It's just the difficulty is crazy. And yeah, we can actually lay down in front of all these machines. That would only be like an extra 2,700, but it's still pretty cool that you could do that. Oh, I should have grabbed Jug or Double Tap to kill all these zombies pretty quick. Uh, I guess this death machine is kind of garbage, but the early rounds, it's not too bad. Oh my gosh, it sounds horrible too. Oh, and you have to reload it too. That's, that's probably the worst part about this death machine. Yeah, I don't even want it, to be honest. Uh, we almost got this filled up. Oh, it is filled up. Ooh, what do we got here? We got the AUG, nice. I think this is a Black Ops 1 weapon. I don't care for the sight whatsoever, but I guess we'll use it for now. Don't want to get hit by the train. And yeah, there's also a gun game I forgot to mention. I think you have to start the gun game by like round 2 or 3. And there was actually a shield part right here. I was coughing when I picked it up, so that part's not going to be in the video. Yeah, my allergies have been pretty bad lately, so my voice probably sounds kind of weird. I apologize. Yo, this gun is actually pretty good. Holy crap. I've been sticking to wall weapons because I've been scared of wasting points on the box, but I probably should have been going for box weapons. Might make the map a little easier. Oh my goodness, zombie. You're crazy. We need to get Jug. There's boss zombies that are going to come soon. And we don't need to die right off the bat. And we'll grab double tap to help us out. I don't know which round they spawn on. I know it's like six or seven, maybe eight. I swear one time they spawned on like round five. And I was not ready for them. Bro, I am not a fan of this site though. It's kind of making me not want to use it. That's why I'm hip firing a lot. Bro, holy crap. This The clip is terrible. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we gotta go for a different weapon. Oh, we'll grab that cash. And here's another shield part. 
Almost accidentally bought that max ammo. Yeah, that's a little max ammo machine right there. Whoa. Oh my gosh. And we got this area. It kind of looks like buried. That's why it said the buried part of the map was open as soon as we turned power on. Grab that. Got some freaking vulture aid. We need another shield part. And we got freaking pack a punch too. The Black Ops 4. Okay, we're just gonna head back. Where is that last shield part? I think that's part of the acid get. Oh yeah, the, the last shield part is right here. Pick this crap up. Okay, we're gonna go for another box hit. Or I guess our first box hit. Okay, what is this? Oh, heck no. Nah. The Olympia? Oh my gosh, I almost got trapped right there. Oh, why is it giving us crappy weapons? Yeah, there's actually like four different Call of Duty uh, sets of weapons in here. So that'd be kind of cool to see all the weapons. The G11. Yeah, this is why I didn't want to hit the box. Because we're just getting a bunch of crappy weapons. The K yet? Bro, give us a good weapon. Uh, the HVR, I guess. But the HVR, we could have got off the wall. So that kind of sucks. Uh, what? Oh my gosh, bro. Whoa, there's two freaking boss zombies already. Excuse us. Oh my goodness. I'm so glad I got that trap set off. We probably would have died right there. Ah, these boss zombies don't die if you don't have a pack punch weapon. It's kind of insane. Ugh. Move. Goodness, bro. Just die. Bro, I think that grenade actually did something. Holy crap. I think it killed the mangler too. What the heck? Yo, I did not think the grenades were actually going to do anything. They just saved us right there. Uh, we're going to go ahead and buy this. This will increase our damage for all our weapons. Ah, dude was set on fire. Okay, we need like 2200 to open up the door over here. Because this is like the only somewhat open area in the map. Yeah, here we go. Let's open this up. Yeah, I guess the HVR was a good gun to get. I wish I bought it from the wall buy, but that's fine, I guess. So, I know I've been posting a lot of custom zombie maps lately. And that's mainly because I'm trying to do an Easter egg video. So, I've been having to uh, attempt the Easter egg like several times. But I am working on that video, so just keep a lookout for that. Oh, bro, did I... I didn't make the shield, did I? That's not good. We need to go make the shield. And we do not want that death machine. That will kill us. Oh, the freaking crawlers are going to kill us, actually. Ah! I almost got trapped right there. So yeah, before we do anything else, we are getting ourselves a shield. Yeah, give me that shield, bro. And there are bonfire cell drops on this map. So I'm kind of waiting on that to uh, pack a punch my weapons. Oh my goodness, there's actually quite a bit of zombies left. I did not realize that. So, it doesn't really matter which weapon we end up with, because there's a max ammo thing right here. So, I guess we'll go for another box hit, just to see if we can get something good. Uh, we'll do one more hit. Or not. Not gonna let us. Yeah, I'm done hitting the box, bro. It's such a waste of points. We're just gonna stick with the HVR, which we actually need to go buy ammo for. Holy crap. I think it's right in here. Where's it at? Yeah, ammo. Oh my goodness, that was scary. Ah! Yeah, we need to kill this guy fast. Oh my gosh, bro, die. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm having to reload every five seconds. Yo, I'm grabbing this nuke because I do not want to die to these manglers. Ah, the zombie just dodged our shot. Gonna hit the box again. I'm wasting points, but maybe it'll give us something good. Ooh, I don't know. Oh, this is going to take forever to reload. Oh my gosh. I actually don't want this. <laughs> oh, and the box moved, of course. We still need to fill this crap up. Oh yeah, and the uh, end game is right here for 75000 But we're going to try to get most of the perks, if not all the perks, before we buy that. And I don't want this weapon. We're grabbing the karma. I feel like this would have been a good attempt, but I keep wasting points on the box. So I really don't know anymore. And we still haven't got a bonfire cell, which would have saved us so much cash for pack-a-punching. Ah. 
We are dead, bro. Oh my gosh, how did we get out of that? Our guns are terrible. We need to pack a punch. Bro, I think those zombies are glitched in that corner. They're gonna pop out at like the most random time and kill us. There you go, zombies. Oh my gosh, bro. We're, we don't have one bonfire cell. I'm gonna go ahead and pack a punch the HVR. But yeah, if you're enjoying the video so far, make sure to like and subscribe. It'll really help out the channel. Grab this. Holy crap, that is awesome. And we got turned. I guess that's fine. Okay, I didn't realize this was a dull wield weapon. It's actually really good. I kind of want to get fireworks or dead wire. Dead wire would definitely help us on points. And it triggers a lot. But fireworks, I feel like is it's almost safer than dead wire sometimes. Okay, we got a turn zombie to help us out. Awesome. Okay, he's actually still in all our kills. Okay, turned. You can uh, chill. Whoa, there's actually two turn zombies. What? Oh, gosh. I didn't hear any of the zombies spawning. Bro, we're lacking on points. I think it's because of the turn zombie, but he did help us a lot that round. Holy crap. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, turn zombie. We would have died right there without him. I was trying to go down there to turn on the trap to try to help kill this panzer. Oh, no. Get out of my way. Yo, this is definitely the weapon for this map. Holy crap. Mystery? That was an insta-kill. That wasn't a mystery. Okay, I'm going to try to fill up some of this while we have insta-kill. Uh, that wasn't close enough. Oh, goodness. Oh, heck yeah. Yo, these weapons are definitely the play. And I think turned is too. We don't get as many points, but he is definitely helping. Get back, boy. Uh, please don't trap me. Oh my gosh, almost got trapped right there. Ooh, bonfire cell. We don't really need it. I guess we'll upgrade this. We'll see what double pack we can get on it. Uh, we don't really need two turns. And Thunderwall, that's fine. Definitely using these way more often, though. We need to grab our Speed Cola. Okay, so what I never mentioned is with the keys, there's actually a spot to open up for the uh, Blundergat. But the Blundergat costs like 20k, and we're nowhere near that amount. So that's why I've just been chilling over here. Bro, Turned is helping us so much. What would another good perk be? Let's get Electric Cherry. Might help us. It'd be nice to have dead wire on this. We have one turned and then one dead wire. But we'll stick with this for now. Oh crap, our shield just broke. This is not good. Okay, we are grabbing this. And we are going to get our shield back. It's actually a perfect time. We have our shield right here. Uh, we don't really want Vulture Aid just yet. And yeah, this is what the, uh, the little cats open up. So we can get that little ray gun in there. That'd be nice. So yeah, we can get the ray gun. Or we can get the blunder get. I'm still not sure. Kind of want to just get the blunder get. Alright, that was a good use of the electric bolt. For some reason, we haven't got a max ammo in a while. So I gotta go pay 4,500 for ammo. Because if we run out of ammo with this gun, we are screwed. Oh, and there's a part right here for the blunder get. Or I guess the acid kit. Yeah, look at this. 45 for each weapon. And then like over 800 in the reserve. Kind of insane. Yeah, say we save up for the blunder get. I don't really want to mess with the ray gun. I would like to show y'all, but this map has been so hard. I don't think we need it. I don't want to get the ray gun and then just die with it. Ah. Because, yeah, the ray gun is 15k and the blunder get is 20k. Uh, I guess we'll grab. Oh, crap. I would like to get dead wire, but I don't want to risk dying for a run over to the pack a punch machine. Oh, it's close to the end of the round. Oh, no. Oh my gosh, bro. Uh, we're not going to make it. Oh my gosh. Why did that one spawn right beside us? Oh my gosh, bro. Are you kidding me? Okay, I think there was only three. The round's over. Um, I kind of want to get another perk. What is elemental pop? I don't know. I think we go with winner's, winner's well or uh, widow's wine. Ah! I can't see... 
Oh my gosh, I'm glad I got Widow's Wine. We'll turn that on. Oh my goodness. We left our little safe area. Whoa! Oh crap, bro. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm glad the nuke actually worked. Buried barn has been open. Holy crap, nice. Wait, was that a max ammo over there? I couldn't tell what that was. Dang it, bro. I'm gonna have to waste points some more ammo. Wait. Yeah, it was. It says 650, but it was 4,500. I was about to say this is actually pretty cheap ammo. Uh, I didn't really want that zombies blood, but whatever. Yeah, I feel like we need dead wire or blast furnace. We need points. Fireworks? I don't want fireworks. Oh man, we're we don't have any points, bro. Okay, we'll at least we'll at least get points with this. Whoa! Okay, that was so not fair. Yeah, we mainly run around with these, but pull this out every now and then for a blast furnace. Okay, round 22. I feel like Winter's Well would be uh, pretty good to grab. I don't know if it uses both Widow's Wine and Winter's Well at the same time, though. So, I don't know if that'd be a waste. We're definitely getting it at some point, but I don't know if we should spend 4k right now for it. Or maybe we get Elemental Pop. Does that give you points? Ah! Oh my gosh, get out of my way, zombies. Okay, I think it's close to the end of the round. We need to get dead wire so we can actually get points. We probably won't get it, though. Pretty please, pretty please. Fireworks. Okay, this is the last attempt. Ah, oh, we got Blast Furnace back. Such a waste, bro. Zom shell. Bro, we might actually get Zom shell. Yeah, give us some Zom shell. Okay, we need to watch out for this. Boss zombie. I don't know what it's going to be. Okay, I hear something. There he is. There's one we're going to spawn right here, I think. So we got another one. Get out of here. We're not using that crap. I mean, I guess I can hit it and see what's in here. But uh, I doubt I'm going to grab it. Yeah, we keep getting crappy weapons. Okay, 6,000. What are we going to get? Oh, we'll grab that. That'll help us get more points. It says multi-kills will grant extra points or something okay what is that orb right there is that zom shell okay i don't know if that perk is working but we have quite a bit of points already so i'm gonna assume it kind of is okay yeah i don't know what the heck they're going for that's got to be like the zom shell perk or something all right we have 9k holy crap uh what is another good perk to grab we'll grab icu that's a pretty good one I need to watch out for my ammo, too, because before this round started, I didn't even check. I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna make our way down. Keep in turn, because I think that's what's keeping us alive. If we can get dead wire, though. Oh, dead wire. We barely use this weapon, but every now and then, we can use it for dead wire. Oh, and we do want a bandolier bandit, wherever the heck that is. And I guess vulture aid, so we can get our... Uh, so we can get our points back and get our bullets back. Okay, the Karma actually takes so long to reload. We might want another weapon. But we just took so long to get dead wire on it, so... I don't know. We'll keep it for now. Keep your gun when you go down and get a kill to revive yourself and keep all perks. Uh, yeah, obviously. Alright, gonna let them break our shield. If they want to, I guess. Come on, bro. Oh, crap. The Widow's Wines trapped him right here. Okay, nice. Go down here. Grab a new shield. Gonna grab Vulture Aid. And I have yet to show you all this, but look at this crap. Uh, we don't even have the last key. Okay, so I thought I grabbed this key, but I guess I didn't. And we need to take this key right over here. And it opens this up. And look at this. Got the Blunder Gap for 20k, which I realized I'm probably not going to get because this system has actually been working pretty good. The HVR would turned, and then the Karma with Deadwire, and a crap ton of perks. But we are going to grab another perk. Isn't there a Bandolier Bandit in here? Thought I seen it. And I've heard Mule Kick can glitch out your game, so we're not going to grab that. Oh yeah, we got a bunch of perks over here. 
I don't know. It says something about either you get more points for multi-kills or you get more damage for multi-kills. Something like that. Okay, what other perks are right here? Oh, Bandolier Bandit. Extra ammo for all weapons. Extra ammo appears under HUD. Under ammo on HUD. Okay. Yeah, we're definitely grabbing that. Uh, we don't have enough, though. Yeah, this already has like 800-something bullets. And that'd be nice to have even more. Oh my gosh. Bro, there's a third Panzer? Holy crap. We're using the trap right here. And bro, we have to go in this room and get ammo. I'm so glad I had enough for that. I didn't even pay attention to our points. Oh my gosh, that was scary. They're still alive, so I gotta be careful. Oh my gosh, stop shocking me. Oh my goodness, bro. Is he dead? Ooh, max ammo. I'll grab that. And I know we're low on points, but we're gonna grab Bandolier Bandit. Oh my goodness, watch out. It says plus 90. We only get 90 extra bullets. It's better than nothing, I guess, but for 3,000? Okay, I'm scared to run around with that karma. So yeah, literally just 90 extra bullets for Bandolier Bandit. Uh, we don't really need that, but whatever. We'll take it. Ah. Uh, okay. Get some dead wire kills. Okay, nice. 8K. What other perk can we grab? Oh, we'll get PhD Slider. Okay, it's not working. Ah. Uh, I've used it before, and I know all you have to do is slide for it, so I don't know... What the deal is. Alright, nice. Somehow we kept one zombie alive. Heck yeah. Uh, I guess we'll buy Deadshot. It's only 1500. And what is this? Stone Cold. Uh, we're not really standing still. So we're not gonna get that just yet. Elemental Pop. I'm pretty sure that's really good. Oh, we'll get Stamina up. Oh, yeah, that's nice. That actually made us so much faster. Is it like an upgraded Stamina up? Phase Blaze. Crouching causes a fire startup. We might get that. Okay, we got Dying Wish. Yo, we're getting Dying Wish. And we're going to grab Luna. <laughs> One of my dogs is actually named Luna, so that's that's pretty cool. She'll definitely have our back. I mean, I don't really think I've used Luna that much. If I'm being honest. Wait, is there a boss zombie? thought I felt my controller vibrate. The zombie was just standing still. What the heck? Uh, the zombies are stuck in there again. That's okay. I don't know where Luna is. I haven't seen her. That sucks. It would have been close to having like another turn zombie. Alright, we ended that round. Reload this crap. And we'll grab Winter Well. Oh, there we go. There's Luna. Get out of here, boy. Alright, they are helping us so much. And I'm going to go ahead and buy a max ammo. Just to get more ammo in this. Even though this was pretty much max ammo anyway. Okay, we need a new shield at the end of this round. Or if we get a zombie's blood or something, we can go for it in the middle of the round. Oh! My gosh, bro. The zombie wouldn't die. Okay, we're kind of lacking on points again. We do have a crap ton of perks, so. Heck yeah. Well, PSG Flopper's 4K. I don't remember that. Okay, we got a Panzer. Need to try to get him out of the way super quick. We're actually going to leave this area. Watch out. Holy. Qu Whoa, why am I going so fast? Oh my goodness. That was actually like insanely fast. Ah! Oh, I hope there's no train. My goodness. Ah! Uh, ah! Almost got trapped right there. Bro, we need a shield. That's what we're going for right now. 
Grab us a shield. So, I'm pretty sure that's 22 perks. We only have five more to get. That's not bad. Not bad at all. So yeah, those boss rounds are super sketchy. My gosh. It is not smart to run without the uh without these dull wield weapons. Uh elemental pop. I'm not exactly sure what it does. I think it's kinda like fireworks or something. Okay, we only have one more perk over here. Crouching causes a charge up of fire, standing releases it and flings and flings you forward, igniting zombies. I guess. I hope we don't kill ourselves with it. Let me test it out. I don't know. I thought it had something to do with sliding. It said crouching, but I don't know. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna worry about it. Ah uh, Watch out, zombies. Oh, I hate going back here. I don't know why I keep doing it. Oh, we're dead. We gotta go back this way. Oh my gosh, what was that? The zombies just kept constantly spawning. I couldn't get through there. Yeah, with all these perks, that's the only reason we survived that. I should just fight my way through this little area. I don't see the elemental pop going off. I don't know exactly what that is still. Uh, I guess we'll grab time slip. Oh, crap. Give us some max ammo. I meant to grab ammo. But that is fine. For all we're doing is running around killing zombies. Other than the obvious blundergat and the ray gun, there's not too much else to this map. And like the 27 perks. But we've almost got them all. So elemental pop is literally all the pack-a-punches in a perk. Like all the repacks in a perk. Because every now and then it'll, I'll see like a thunder wall effect, and then I'll see a uh, I'll see a fireworks effect as well. Muscle milk, I freaking guess. Ah, nice. Grab our final perk. Okay, never mind. There's actually two more somewhere. There was mule kick, which we're not getting, because I don't feel like crashing my game. Oh my gosh. So yeah, one more perk somewhere. I think it's PhD. So we'll grab that. Even though we pretty much already have that with PhD slider. We'll grab it anyway. Oh, really don't want to grab that death machine. That will get us killed. Holy crap, we're on round 37. That's kind of insane. Yeah, we'll grab PhD flopper. And the only one we didn't get was meal kick. And I'm fine with that. Ah... Uh... Holy crap, barely fit through that. We're running low on ammo, so I'm trying not to burn through it. Ooh, and as soon as I say that, we get a max ammo. We'll see what other weapons they have. There's actually so many, but we keep getting crappy ones. Oh, double points. Try to make good use out of this. Alright, we got more Panzer spawns. Holy crap. On round 39, holy crap. We've just been kind of flying through these rounds. When there's not boss zombies, it's not that bad. With all these freaking perks. Double points. Holy crap, there's like three double points. What if it just made a really long double points? That would be nice. Yeah, we just kind of been flying through these rounds. So not really anything interesting to show. I think what we will do is buy the Blundergat and Ray Gun right at the end and go like one or two rounds with them yeah i'm probably gonna keep these weapons right here but then do a round with the ray gun and then a round with the uh blunder get just to show it off a little bit assuming we uh don't die before that so we need to save up like a hundred thousand to be able to get everything or actually like a hundred and ten thousand i think oh they broke our shield we need to get down there and get another one okay now they broke our shield I thought I heard it before that. Grab this. Oh my goodness, round 40. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, Get our good weapon out. Holy crap. So yeah, these guys really aren't that bad. It's the uh, Panzer. It's whenever the Panzer spawn in. That's when it gets difficult. So I've played this map so many times. I can't remember if I showed this. But look, you can change the actual... The way the map looks. Or at least the sky part of it. I kind of don't like this because it's 
it's dark, but then some parts are like super bright. Kind of tripping me out a little bit. And we got daytime, which is a little bit brighter than what we were doing. And it's almost too bright, so I kind of don't want it. Oh, crap. Let us through. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we're going to set it back to sunset. Yeah, just like this. I think it's the best one. And look at this. If we wanted to, we could just end the game right now. I pressed A instead of X. So if I end up dying, just know I could have beat the map. But I do want to show y'all the rest of this crap we have. I might as well buy this. Oh my goodness. Obviously not going to kill anything right now. And we're going to put this on it. Oh, we got to craft this first. I haven't done this. Place that in there. Pick this crap up. Throw it in there. Nice. Vitrolic withering. Whoa. We can repack it. What? I thought it was good before. Blast furnace. Now uh, we're going to go for dead wire. Oh, dead wire. Ooh, you see that? You can see, the, like, the little blue stuff for dead wire. That's pretty cool. Yeah, we're going to use this and try to get back up to buy the ray gun. Use that for a few rounds, and then I'm going to end the map. Hopefully we don't die. Oh, wait. There's actually a magma gat. We need to figure out how to do that. I assume you do right here, but I'm not 100%. Look at this crap, bro. Oh, my. Did that even do anything? We are on round 43. Oh, my goodness, bro. That is insane. Dang, I should have saved up more points with our dead wire before I got the acid gat. Okay, I looked it up, and I don't know how to get the magma gat. He has the acid gat. And the Blundergat and stuff in his discussions tab, but it doesn't show how to get the Magma Gat. I'm pretty sure this map has the Magma Gat. Because you got the little Magma Gat little builder over there, so I don't know. Alright, so I think you either get the Acid Gat or the Magma Gat. I just watched a video. Someone literally just walked over here and placed it down and got the Magma Gat. So I guess we got the Acid Gat this time. Oh, right, yeah, I guess I can't show you the Magma Gat, because I am not going to freaking save up 20k just to rebuy this. That kind of sucks. We are going to buy this, though. Throw it in here. All right, we're going to head back, use this for the rest of the round, and then I think we're going to end the game. Yeah, look at this. It's like a an automatic ray gun. I can't tell if there's, like, bullet penetration or what. Oh, we need freaking turn zombie to help us. Yeah, look at this crap. I don't think it's bullet penetration, so. But it is automatic, so that's nice. Oh, I thought there was more to the round than this, but. Oh, there is. The zombies are just being slow. Okay, that is the end of the round. And we're going to end this crap. Round 46. Uh, pretty much all the perks. Holy crap, and we get hit by the train. <laughs> what the heck is that? Alright, guys. That's gonna do it for this video. I might have made that map look a little easy, but I'm telling you, that crap was hard. I think the only reason we made it is because I got that dual wield weapon after we pack-a-punched, and we got turned on it. I wasn't even attempting to go for turned, but since we got it, it actually helped us so much. And I think I might have used Dying Wish once. There was one part of the video where I just sped up like super crazy. I'm thinking that was Dying Wish. So that definitely saved us from going down once and keeping us with no downs to beat the map. And I felt way more comfortable near the end. So it was easy for me to just swap out my one weapon for the Blundergat and the Ray Gun to try to get that in the video to show you guys. And the map creator is super dope. You could tell he put a lot of time and effort into this map. And that's not to downplay any other map creator. I think they're all awesome. I don't even know where to start when it comes to creating a map. But yeah, in my opinion, I think this had great balance. Crap ton of perks. And it was pretty difficult, but not stupid difficulty. Like, it's definitely possible if you can figure the map out. The map creator does have three more maps. The two sequels to this map and the original version of the map we just played. 
So I will be playing all of those at some point. But yeah, if there's any other custom map that you want me to try out, just leave a comment down below. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe and turn those notifications on. And yeah, I'll see y'all in the next one.